In his reply to questions during cross-examination, the Deputy Director of the Police Criminal Intelligence and Investigations Directorate, Godfrey Musana, told court that disagreements emerged after the Director of Public Prosecutions, or DPP, preferred murder charges against Jacqueline Uwera Nsenga. Police, which led the investigations, had insisted that the murder charge was far-fetched and proposed that it be revised, pending another investigation into the case. This prompted the prosecution team to task Musana to explain whether he knows the role of the police and the DPP in regard to investigations and what charges to lay against an accused person. Musana told court that following the disagreements between police and the DPP, police sought advice from the Attorney General. But when asked for a copy of the letter seeking advice, the Deputy CIID Chief could not produce it. It also emerged in court that Uwera was in police custody for about six months without being charged for any offence. On Tuesday, Uwera told court that after she accidentally ran over her husband, Juvenal Nsenga, with a car, leading to his death, she sought police protection after her in-laws Moses and Joseph Kananura threatened to kill her. Musana told court that police secured Uwera at the Special Investigations Unit in Chireka, which is a Kampala suburb. When the prosecution cross-examined Uwera, she seemed to contradict herself on the actual property her husband Nsenga owned. On Tuesday, she had also told court that Nsenga owned about 80 trucks, but it has now emerged that the vehicles belong to a company that he co-owned with his father. Even pieces of land at Nalukolongo and on 6th Street Industrial Area, say to belong to Nsenga, were registered under Katrago Company, where he was a shareholder.